Hello, I'm Giles Darling and I write novels, plays and non-fiction books. In this video I read out loud a short story or text that I wrote as homework for a writing group that I go to. If you're interested, there's more information in this video's description below. But first, please feel free to like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Just a couple of clicks, it costs nothing and it's free. Also, when you've finished watching this video, please check out the rest of my channel, especially where I talk about the various books that I've written. I hope my channel encourages you to buy my books, available on Amazon, see the link below, and to read them if you haven't already done so. What's more, every so often, the ebook versions can be downloaded for free. Now let's get back to the video. On this occasion, the prompt was write something containing the words blue strobe. This is what I wrote. Blue? A woman in an angular dress pokes her head round the door to the study. Are you in there? Go away. A middle-aged man in t-shirt and shorts sits slumped at an oversized desk. But the press coverage is great. The woman steps into the room and holds up her phone. On the screen is a press release with the headline, Fantastic! Marvellous! She shows it to Blue. Take it away. It means nothing to me. What do you mean? You spent years working on this. And despite the setbacks... They weren't setbacks. Blue swivels round in his chair. They were strategic reassessments. Whatever. The woman scrolls down the screen. Look! She holds the phone up again and points at it. They even have a photo of you at the launch. I look old. Blue passes a gold ring bedecked hand through his thinning hair. You look distinguished. The woman smiles back. It doesn't matter. Why not? Scroll to the bottom. The woman scrolls down the screen a bit more. What am I looking for? My name. They left out a full stop. Oh, the woman stifles a laugh. So I see. Instead of blue saint robe, they wrote blue strobe. The end. Well, I hope you enjoyed that. I always have fun planning and writing them. What would you have written if faced with the same prompt? Is there anything you would have changed or added, bearing in mind the limited word count? If so, please feel free to add your comments below. Also, if you like my writing style, perhaps you'd enjoy reading my novels and plays too. They are often similar in tone. Before you go, please don't forget to like and subscribe this video on my YouTube channel, and to buy and read my books, available on Amazon, see the link below, if you haven't already done so. Thanks for watching. Come back soon.